Oh yeah, I, I definitely think this is going to be appropriately named Let's Fail at Castlevania! Or something. Or Let's Fail Castlevania episode... 8? <laughs> Just letting you know now! Hey, to all those who have returned for episode 8. So, uh, after doing a poll, you guys are going to love this, after doing a poll of what game I should do next, because I had four four of them listed and whatever, and there are a few of them that, that I vaguely know and wanted to pick back up, because um, recently I defeated a few games that I wanted to do. Um, I guess would be the way to say it. So I guess after I'm done with Castlevania, I'm going to fail at the original 1996 long box version of Resident Evil. I love survival horror as a genre, and I know of survival horror, especially Silent Hill, obviously, very well. Um, because apparently... I've beaten the Greatest Hits versions, and I don't really pay attention to how many saves I do, but I remember on the Greatest Hits versions, which I have, the director's cut and all that, um, I had the Rocket Launcher and the Colt Python, but uh, I never finished the original 96 version that started it all for me, and the one that my dad played. There's a lot of memories to that one, and when I was six years old, getting introduced to Resident Evil. But, um, that story will be for next time. Uh, I think I got was over here. Now, seeing that this place isn't really that dialogue heavy, um, what I'm gonna start with is just wandering around aimlessly until I get something good. <laughs> um, if there's any repeats, a lot, of, a lot more backtracking. I'll just edit it out and whatever later in post. Yeah, not that impressive, I know. <laughs> there he is. Anyway. Uh, that's why it's kind of my goal to try and finish up, um, uh, try, try and finish up the remainders of this game. I'm not trying to rush it out, it's just, now I got Parasite Eve, uh, Tactics Ogre, Brave Fence Musashi, and doesn't need all to worry about. And I just keep making a list. I don't want to force the echo, but I have my fireball. Sort of done! Tombstones. In certain areas like this, you will see me do the bat form more. Mainly because it's more accessible than keep on trying to press down up jump. <laughs> <clears throat> Obviously. I'm gonna do something that's more simplized. Did I go over here and collect what was over here? Yeah, it was a lightning nail. Okay. Back down to the menu trick again. That way the game doesn't freeze on me while I'm trying to play it. Sad face. As I am talking, I actually slept I am in the process of uploading episode 7, and I'm just doing this so that I don't feel as overwhelmed. I was trying to get it done all in one shot, but my body is like, come on, 
You're not 16 anymore. <laughs> uh, it kind of sucks. God, I can't believe how old I am. I feel, I don't feel like I'm pushing 30. You know, I know I'm a couple years off, but... It's like, you think of the 90s, and it's like, oh, that wasn't too long ago. I think, no, that was... That was 30 years ago. <sighs> oh, God, don't, don't tell me that... Because I didn't do the menu trick, that it's going to go and freeze on me now. Seriously? Yeah, it froze. Damn. Here I am like, I know I opened up a a can somewhere. And I just made a mess. Are you serious? Ah, uh, I still need to wake up. I, I had a pretty long night getting a lot of the episodes uploaded and whatever else, but... <sighs> cool, darn it. Let's try this again. No. <laughs> Inconveniences and inconsistencies. I don't know. What else do you want me to say? Other than making an idiot of myself? True. Hello. Mhm. Mm you know, I never got the point of those hallways. But at the same time, I think it's because they wanted to make sure that CD was being read. I don't know. Maybe there's a good reason to it. Rick. Hey, look at that. I actually got a sword for it. <clears throat> Maybe there's just some areas that take a lot more than whatever. But I'm still trying to figure it out, you know, why, why can't certain emulators just handle Castlevania? It's a sprite game, it's not Silent Hill. Well, I'm gonna keep saying that till the end of my days. This pisses me off. You know what I hate in this area? It's got to be... Um... It's got to be the imps. Anyway, for those that don't know what I'm talking about, I'll get around to it. wish they gave her something more than that. Because I really like how she has her own voice and whatever, but Medusa's just... Meh. <laughs> it's like, oh, come on, really? You're gonna go and do that? I'm gonna go and cut it out, yep. I'm gonna turn the other card back into human, human form, so I can't go and... <sighs> do what is necessary. I hate doing the Black Panther. That's exactly why I do the wolf. I can't recall anybody who likes the Black Panthers. Just trying to look for a job. What is this? Is this better than what I have? No. Because apparently after grabbing the holy sword, I don't need any other sword. Well, until I get the other card sword. Come on. Huh. 
I have the poison circle in arm if anybody wants to know what I'm doing. See a way to get level ups, by the way. That's why I chose this area first. Come on, Donald, jump! Come on. I like how they introduce reintroduce the snipers of Goth in which one? Dawn of Sorrow? Was it with Sonya? I don't remember. And here is the toilet coke. I should I'm already wearing the Sprite Breaker. And I know I didn't get the, the prolonged form of the mist or whatever. It's because I don't only really use mist. It's a, it's a cop-out. <laughs> At least, according to my theory, it's a cop-out. And I won't wear the Toilet Cloak mainly because it just has one more concentration. And though it's beautiful and all that, I'm going to be wearing the Joseph Cloak throughout the rest of the playthrough. I would love to do a version of Castlevania inspired by by this game, but I don't think it's going to be for a while, so... Oh yeah, there is an area that's like absolute slowdown, I remember that. So be prepared for that, it's not the emulator, it's it's an actual thing. Should I go here first? No. <laughs> well, that made up my fine fast. I just don't want the... These, these guys. I mean, the only thing they give you is luck potions, but come on! Did the, did the, did the music seriously cut out again? Hm. No imps! No imps! I'd rather get hurt by them by than, than possessed. And then they become annoying. Oh my god. Bastards. I hate them so much. Look at that, I said that about a lot of enemies. <laughs> Do I really need hearts? No. Solution solved. I think I'm heading towards the caverns esque area first. So I have to go through the alchemy lab. The other thing you hear is my voice. Why can't you emulate Castlevania correctly? It's just a sprite game! You've emulated Silent Hill! But you can't, for some reason, emulate this game correctly. Hey, hate him! Fire boomerang. 
You're probably wondering why I don't really use a lot of items other than use lose use a lot of items other than uh what's been given to me. Are you better not watching that happen from afar? Are you, are you gonna be done with me yet? Here, come on. Thank you very much for doing that to me. Hey, look, a diamond. Aren't diamonds, like, really rare in this game? I, I don't recall ever getting them one. Jewel hunting. So that should show you how difficult that is. You have to be smart with the imps. <sighs> they, uh... They don't like playing nice. Really? This is exactly why I don't like knockback in games. I get that if you're gonna do it every now and again, but as a developer and and a gamer, I hate it. You know, I don't I don't get why Castlevania think it's still cool, even still to this day. It's not. You're just making people frustrated. Do it right. I mean, like I can understand if you're gonna take out huge chunks of health, but if you constantly do it over small things, like arrows. Arrows do not knock you back. They piss you off. Oh, really? Jeez. Anyway, that. I'm glad it didn't slow down. It's probably because if you try and rush there, so all you're gonna get is attitude! I've been playing this for four hours? Jeez. Got all my health back. I hate when I'm trying to pop my ears. Oh, I hate that sensation. <gasps> And it's like, why can't I hear you? I don't know. Altitude change. That's why it's gonna rain again today. Downfall about living in Wisconsin. You get a lot of rain and snow. People say, oh, it must be nice to live in the snow. No, not here. <laughs> There's a reason why uh, we're isolated here. Like, quite literally, there's a reason why we're isolated here. I'm gonna go ahead and take- should I take care of Belize above? Am I gonna be back in this area? Hmm, that's a good question. I'll take care of him. This is a fight where you need the... Um, this is a fight where you need the uh, poison circlet. Don't go like fool you. I also hate how the bees do 40 points of health to you. Doesn't matter how high a level you are or how many points you have. <laughs> or whatever. Here, have a shirt on steak. Another card. card. Protein! No. <laughs> uh, the holy sword there, babe. Oh. 
Oh, for God's sake. That's annoying. You just gotta be more prepared for it. Or however. Uh, hmm. Uh, she has some shiitake mushrooms. Wow. Didn't I just... No, okay, well, whatever. Help is help. This is where the majority of your health items will disappear. I'm not surprised by it. This is why I debated taking care of them. Anyway. Really? This is why I get rid of the more and more harder bosses first. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. I can get rid of the toadstools now. Yeah, it's one of the more annoying bosses for me. Even me being ex uh, an experienced player as I am. Really? Really? <sighs> Constantly summons these bees and oh my god, they do 40 hit points to each. Doesn't matter what level you are, doesn't matter how many healing items you have. He'll kick your ass. <laughs> I'm not gonna use the peanuts because they're annoying to eat. Coming soon! <laughs> um, a playthrough where other crows is just using his hands. <laughs> No armor either. The gust. I gotta be insane. Really? This is why I hate Beelzebub. It's not because he's difficult to get to or whatever, it's just the constant bees. Gotta learn how to how to hit him. You know what sword is good against them? That that dodo bird. Uh, that that I don't know why I keep calling my dodo bird. I don't know what it's called. All I know is that you get to f throw a flying sword at things. <laughs> I don't remember the sword and how to pronounce its name. But that's the only thing I know is that you get to use flying swords against it. Stupid me. <laughs> uh with that, though, with that in mind, I probably should wait until I get that sword then. A kingstone? When did I get that? That was probably earlier. Stone. And that is added plus whatever. One, one, last one. One, one. Huh. I mean, it's a little a bit better, but... I'm gonna go ahead and get that other sword so I can deal with him easier. I know where to get it from, too. I just can't remember how to pronounce it. <laughs> Whatever it is. So yeah, people who wanted to see me die. There, you saw me die. Not today, imps! I hate these things. 
have to be quick. Yeah, I'm gonna leave Beelzebub until I can get the other sword, which shouldn't be uh, too hard to get if I if I uh, if I take my time with it to go and grab it. Really? Hey, I'd rather take one hit point of damage rather than 50. Nope, oh, there goes... This is why this part of the castle is so frustrating! Okay. Huh. Thing is, is that you can't even see the butterflies until they make themselves known, and I swear to God, that is why I hate knockback! I don't care what game you are, if you do knockback on a character, and unless it's reasonable, I'm kicking your ass. I will frustrate the hell out of you, and if I do anything that's cliche, and like, makes fun of whatever, that's the first thing I'm gonna, gonna mention in side-scrollers. I get you're supposed to take damage, but come on, be reasonable. <laughs> this hasn't become an enjoyable session. This one's gonna be let's let's rage at Castlevania. Right? 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 No? no of course not. <laughs> you should hear me when I play games like Dark Souls. I rage, <laughs> and I rage even more. <clears throat> But yeah, I'm gonna go and get that sword that's more convenient for me to hit the Yelzebub. And, uh... I think that'd be my, my playthrough for this one, but I'm not sure. And see, this is exactly why I say don't do stuff that makes me mad! Don't do stuff that makes anybody mad! People are just gonna be mad at your game. Just like that boss in Majora's Mask. Oh my god, everybody knows what boss I'm talking about. The one that you have to go and try and fiddle with the, the camera angle. Oh my god, no. Screw fiddling with that camera angle. <laughs> I'm getting mad at this playthrough. Hey, wait! What was that? Oh, it's, oh, it's just the katana. <coughs> Well, I'm not dealing with it today! Not today, Satan! <clears throat> I like how those guys die, too. <clears throat> Not today, Satan! <coughs> I'll check this way later. Yeah, the, the alchemy, uh, alchemy lab is one of the harder parts of the game. Kinda just makes you mad. There's Cthulhu! Bye Cthulhu. He can be annoying just as well as anybody else. So 
so get rid of him as fast as you can. Ah, oh, I need that other sword. That or other card sword. I don't remember where I get other card sword. It's <laughs> somewhere in this castle. Oh. Ah, well. Menu trick. This is another reason why I hate knockback. Are oh, you trying to get up to this area? No, this magical shuriken thing that's thrown at you. No, it's gonna send you into your previous floor, wherever you're trying to get at. Sorry. Prevent you from getting anywhere. I get it if you're gonna do it with major hit points, but small hit points give me a break. It's just annoyance. No, I don't plan on modding Castlevania. Like, period. I don't plan on modding Castlevania. I don't want to mod Castlevania if I'm gonna be making my own Castlevania-inspired game. I'm being serious, by the way. You know, they could have been better off creating a whole new area where it's like Shaft's castle or chapel or something. But no, let's just invert the castle that you're already explored through. It's kind of lame, guys. Come on. You're smarter than that. I know you are. Don't give me the excuse. Dodo bird. <laughs> Nothing yet. I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> I, I guess this is one of the more frustrating episodes. I mean, hell, if you guys like it, then you guys will like it. Oh, wait until I grab a hold of the original 96 version of, uh... <sighs> the original 96 version of Resident Evil. I played the greatest hits, but not the... Not the original 96 version in ages. Up the sword. Too much damage. Nope, you're gonna be sent flying back. <laughs> Castlevania slash Konami and all that people who've worked on it. It's not cool. Never has been cool. Never will be cool. You wanna know why? It just makes people mad. Don't do it.
Thank you. He dropped a hundred bucks, but he doesn't drop what I want! It's a hard sword to get, I'm not gonna lie. I hate things that leap at you. I hate things that twist and turn at you. I hate things that make you be knocked back. Common sense here, people! I'll bring it back. I'm not gonna have you guys sit through this. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No way! No way! No way! I've never acquired the stone outside of outside of doing the the, the name entry cheat, whatever the hell you want to call it. Seriously? Forty-four. I'll go with 49. That! Oh my god! And what chances? Never in all my life I, I acquired that item outside of typical, you know, things you would find online on saying, Hey, here's how you put a name, and this is how you get this jewel, and... Get extremely lucky, so apparently now I can get that sword better. <laughs> That's, uh... That blows my mind. Like, quite literally, that blows my mind. Obviously. Let me go ahead and, uh... Clear this area, then go back for the sword. I haven't gotten the sword yet. I was sitting there for at least a good 20 minutes. I had to go and switch for a little. That's exactly what I'm talking about. <sighs> there goes my lucky item! <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> yeah, the, the inverted castle isn't that, um... Pet friendly. But knowing that the item is there, I should go in for it, right? I'll be back. I will be back. Because knowing that the item is there, I, I never knew that the item was there, obviously. I gotta go for it. See you guys in a minute. Huh, god darn it. I'm cheesing out this area in a sense. Just get rid of it. No! God damn it. I hate how the Nova Skeletons are easy to defeat. They do so much damage on you. That's the main reason why I got a game over in the first place. <laughs> I get enemies need to be hard, but come on, really? If, if a normal enemy does two, three hundred damage points on you, and then you just make your players frustrated, and turn it down a little. I get if you can do it once, or every now and again, or however, but not all the time. That's nitpick, Castlevania. Hmm. Seems like a totally legit thing. Totally seems like a legit thing. Just me out in Castlevania, Nova Skeletons. <laughs> mm. 
Are you gonna hit me with thorns? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> the stressful question of the day. Are you gonna hit me with thorns? <laughs> So I feel you're almost expecting it. Which is the enemy that dropped it? Does anybody know? No, I'm just gonna end up just speed running this hallway until I'm done with it. Why can't you just keep that dragon thing? That'd be awesome to have as a familiar. Dear people who hacked this game, make that thing a familiar. <laughs> I know you can do it! Don't be putting excuses on me. Because that'd be awesome to have a dragon like that. Really? 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 Oh my god. I should probably heal myself, huh? No, yeah, that probably be smart. Yeah, I'm not surprised at all that when you first enter the inverted castle, it is hard. And I get you're supposed to do a challenge, but come on. Um. I'm a familiar. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh and and grind for um two items now. <laughs> it would just make my life so much easier. It really would. And I, I need that sword if I'm gonna get by Yuzelbeb because Unless I had Alucard sword, but I don't see myself getting that anytime soon. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna demonstrate the shield here. Wait, I don't have Alucard shield though. Damn. Okay, never mind. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> You know, I'm gonna laugh if what gives you that, that Lupus Azul or whatever it's called that you normally put in cheats to get. <laughs> We've all done it! Whoever's played Castlevania before. I bet you anything. I bet you anything it's gonna be the Nova Skeleton. It's gonna make me mad. <laughs> Cause that wouldn't surprise me one bit. No, I should I should go and Google that. All right, give me a second. Okay, so I looked it up. It's chopped by that um. God, that that dragon thing. So what I can do, instead of just torturing myself to go through that hallway, is go through the other hallway. Woohoo! Gimme. It's dropped by the guy who likes to hop at me. In lamest terms. Ooh. 
At least I think. Give me a second. Okay, so they say the only possible way to get it is on the right side. So... I'm gonna be farming for that, and I guess the left side will do with the sword. But I'm gonna get the sword after I get the ring. It was then that I decided, nah. <laughs> it really isn't worth it. I died at least three or four different times the level I am. But I expect to get anything, I'm gonna need to be a hard lady. Or have the appropriate equipment. And I wouldn't mind having, uh... I wouldn't mind having a card sword or something better than what I already have! God damn it, would you stop with this bullshit?! <laughs> Seriously! Yes. Fucking skeletons. It's the only reason why I keep dying! Once in a million chance to get that god damn ring, and I just ended up dying. Man, mad. <laughs> yes, it's a frustration. Oh, thank you very much for giving me that karma coin. Thank you so very much. I don't know if that's the game's way of yelling at me and just being like, you know, just deal with it! You're not fun. <laughs> You're not fun when you do that, Castlevania. You're laughing at me. <laughs> Get rid of them Nova Skeletons first. Guys do give uh good experience though. I'm just not the appropriate level to farm in this place. What was I thinking? <clears throat> Told you I sucked! <laughs> not gonna sugarcoat that. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the caverns. Or, I might as well call it an episode here. Um... I'm gonna- I'm gonna probably be like, oh, I'm- I'm done here. The emulator sure has to be done with me, you know? <laughs> mm. I'll- I'll depart when I find a safe point. God damn it, see?! <laughs> Let's go and just piss you off even more. That's why I usually have the wolf. Alucard! The Alucard shield! Oh! Oh, bless the heavens! Yay! Okay, so let's see, uh... Might as well, if I'm gonna go and cheese it a little bit. I don't mind. You guys are gonna see this be awesome. Watch, it's great. For those who don't know how the shield rod works. I might do this to get a few level ups. Oh, 
Or, 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 I just got a good idea. <laughs> We're going back. We got the shield, and I might as well farm for it. Because, oh my god. I've had it. I want my revenge. <laughs> Great. I'm going to go ahead and save it over here then. I'm over here and all that. No, I'm not going to use the shield to help my playthrough. Make myself look cheap. I mean, it's possible, but I'm not going to. I may do it as laughs and do a bonus video and be like, Yeah, you can defeat Dracula in 12 seconds! I'll use it as a bonus video. There's no challenge when you just use this shield rod and another card shield. It's good to farm, though. Good to gain extra experience. Which I think I'm going to go ahead and do and grab that ring and the sword wall in here. So, uh, I'll see you guys in a minute.